and welcome to James the Lessons Express Lane, where we get you out as fast as possible. That's right, what we have here is another Sue Metal Solo. <coughs> Baby Metal Tamashi no Rufuran. I to that, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. But yes, more Sue Metal. Hot. Kitsune up. <laughs> as a, I don't know, the last one only got copyright claimed. That was pretty cool. I've been getting blocked worldwide lately, so I had to go through, edit, blur stuff out. But no, the last one was only copyright claim, so yay! Maybe this one will only be copyright claim too. Awesome. But yes, because of that. Copyright claim, don't care. A lot of this stuff gets copyright claim. Whatever, it happens. Just stop blocking me world. Well, although I do say block me worldwide instead of copyright strike. Copyright strike, you kind of bone. Blocked worldwide, you can edit the video, which I do. But anyways, enough of that. Here we go, and uh. Do, toi, click. Yay. More Sue Metal. <gasps> Wait a minute. This sounds familiar. I don't watch these videos beforehand. This sounds really familiar. So the beginning of White Love. But the video is different. Yay, baby metal. The last video is 2012, this is from 2013, so it's gotta be a different video. So do they do an intro for all of her solos, maybe? That's probably, what, that's probably what it is. Now that's a cool symbol. And here we go. There we go. There's the Kasune up time. Two thousand thirteen, so she would have been sixteen ish at the time. Performance in front of this huge crowd. issue right now is that her vocals are lower than the music so you can barely hear her.
by about four minute mark. Cause that was just amazing by her voice. Remember, she's like maybe at oldest sixteen in this. Great drum work, by the way. Uh, we're going for the 515 mark. I'm not just laying out. So, four minute and 515 mark. man you're 16 years old and you're known as the metal goddess because you were crucified live on stage remember metal queen and metal goddess after being crucified on stage in front of thousands and you're doing a genre that while existing in Japan was probably not the most popular. I mean, probably still not the most popular genre in Japan, but. All right, four minute mark. Just get that note going for a good three seconds. Longer than I could probably do it. I bet you can't hear the voice better. Like the instruments are too loud in this video, but you can still hear just that. The way she's able to carry that note, amazing. Okay, she doesn't hold the note as long as I thought she did in that part, but. Do you. Eh. I'm trying to think of a good one. Like, Whitney Houston. I wonder if she had that good of a voice when she was 16. Maybe she did, maybe she didn't. I don't know. I don't think I've ever heard her sing at the age of 16. Like, I, I can't carry... I've never been able to carry a note. But I've noticed... Uh, someone I went to high school with, they got to perform uh, the national anthem before... Uh, what? It was a uh, L.A. Lakers game. Like, they were out of school for like three days because they... Flew out to LA to perform the national anthem at that game. So like, I've known people who are just amazing singers when they were young. But a lot of times, like, you know, it takes voice work, it takes training, it takes coaching. Some people know they just wake up one day and go, Oh hey, it turns out I can sing, and not just in the shower. Everyone can sing in the shower. Even I can sing in the shower. Yeah. But to be that young and be able to carry notes like that, amazing. Yeah. Yeah, people way older than still can't do that. Like me. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys for watching. As always, like, subscribe, comment down below, and have one hell of a day.